What's up, Word Nerds? Here we are again. It is Tuesday, December 19th, 2023. Welcome back to Alpha Bento. My name's Lawrence, and I am going to solve today's New York Times crossword by Seth Whiteberg. And you can follow along by looking at the clues I am looking at right up there above the grid uh, that way in blue. One uh, across, we've got Atari 2600. Got to be Atari. Heck yeah. Let's look down. Sort of suffix is ish. Guitar accessories. Picks, maybe? Uh, what's... RK doesn't look good, does it? Mechanical repetition is rote, I think. So it's not going to be picks. Cap Capos. That's got to be it. Capital of Ghana is Accra, I think. Uh, Prey Snatcher is a Talon. Issue a mea culpa. Apologize... Is this roll? A capacity is roll. Is that right? Capacity is roll? Oh, like you work in what capacity? Uh, the, yeah, that's roll. Your broad is ano. Yes. And 17 across. This cardboard belt is a waste of paper, for example. Okay. Uh, that's kind of funny. The homophone there with waste. Uh, okay. Don't know what that answer is, but I like that. Raised. Um, I'm not sure what that is. Up, raised, raised. Uh, white tees and blue jeans, for example. Clothes? White tees and blue jeans. I don't know. Blank to comp. Uh, I feel like this is a, a like a ballet thing, like plie or something like that. I'm not totally sure, though. Hit the ball out of the park, say, Homer, maybe? End of an academic address, edu. Uh, Fox's refuge, a den. What is this? Raised? Huh. Uh, huh. Hmm, boy, okay. Maybe Homer's wrong. I don't know. All right, I'm just going to go. keep going. We'll come back to that area. Worker Welfare Organization OSHA, uh, close by, near, and like the Gobi, arid. Let's look at the downs, or no, 22, what's 22? Sharp increase. Spike, maybe? How hors d'oeuvres may be served on a platter? Typo typographical embellishment, a serif. 17 syllable verse, a haiku. French forest in a Shakespeare Shakespeare play. Arden, I want to say. Not totally sure about that. Let's go over here. Twenty-one across. Noon on some clocks. Noon on some clocks. One? Is it one? What is that? Noon on some clocks is one. Is it? That's weird. I don't know what that what clocks that is referencing. Uh, let's see. Ticked as a box. Checked. Ticked as a box. Done, maybe? I guess it's one. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. That's odd. Good times doing bench presses. Hmm. Well, something fun. That makes sense. Good times. Took a load off, sat. Uh, okay, we'll come back to that. Canvases for crossword construction. Constructors. Canva is this grids? Is done wrong? Maybe done is wrong. Maybe one is wrong. I don't know. This might be grids. I feel like this is grids. Where tourists might take a picture of themselves seemingly holding up a tower. That's Pisa for sure. Good times doing bench. Pectoral fun? Yeah, I feel like Homer is wrong. Okay, let's go with pec pectoral fun. So, pectoral fin is a thing, and that's been changed to fun, I guess. Oh, is that what's happening here with this U also, maybe? Oh, it's UN at the end. Uh, 
Uh, hmm, what could this be? Ticked as a box. This might be okayed. Noon on some clocks. I don't know, it might not be okay. Ticked as a box. White tees and blue jeans. Man, I do not know for this area. Why is this so hard? <laughs> it fall out of the park. Nail it? Something it? Uh. Oh, is this XII? That's what it is. Xed, maybe. Um. Clothes pun. Clothes pin became clothes pun. There we go. There's a good clothes pun, too. All right. Hit the ball out of the park. Maybe rip it. Raised. Uh, bread. Basics. Oh, man. Gosh, that took a while to get. Aid de comp. No idea what that is. But basics, that makes sense. Rip it. Okay. All right. Very good. Whew. Iridescent gem opal. Singer Rita Aura. Is this pita? Yeah, bread for Baba Ganesh Rita. Granola grain is an oat. Billy the Kid for one. Billy the Kid for one. Don't know. Let's look at the Dallas largest movie theater chain in the world. Maybe AMC? Don't know. Hilarious in a text. LOL. Oh, Billy the Kid is an alias. That makes sense. Okay. Egyptian ruler, Cleo. And what do we have going across? Why the pizza oven is so hard to clean. Mozzarella. Something. Mozzarella stick. Mozzarella. What else could... It's part of the theme, so it's going to be... Is it UN at the end, maybe? Let's see. Mozzarella, mozzarella Cinephiles Channel. Is this, this is not AMC, I guess. <coughs> Cinephiles Channel. HBO? I don't know. Reusable shopping bag. A tote. T TCM, Turner Classic Movies, maybe? Uh, oh, yeah. No, it is. It, it was mozzarella stick, became mozzarella stuck. Okay. Scrape out is eke out. Uh, curious. Huh? This is OLH. Shabby, maybe. Nope. Old. Curious. Odd. Shout with laughter. Roar. Little Whirlpool and Eddie. Auditioned, maybe. Don't know that. I want a turn. Uh, let me. Bed frame piece uh, slat. And what do we have here? Blank poker bluffing game. Uh, bluffing game. I don't know. Desire in the dessert aisle. Mollusks name for their shape. Razor something? Razorbacks? Is that a thing? Audition would be red. Snake-like fish and eel. Blank Haran. Irish musician? No idea. Oh, no, I do know that. That's no. Uh, nipping pests. Nets. Nettles. Don't know. Like some wine barrels. Oaken? Alka Seltzer. Overflow with his team and Tax Form Figures SSN uh, no wait SSNs. This is Razor Clams. Grocery. What was Riles? Nettles is Riles, okay. Grocery. Is there in the dessert aisle? Cart, grocery, something that has an I that gets changed to a U. Grocery, 
aisle, gro no, grocery, cart, grocery, bag, grocery, man, I can't think of it, darn, uh, all right, let's keep going, stock advice, maybe a tip, summertime, quaff, don't know, hand in Spanish, mano, start of some advice, uh, or a phonetic hint, 17, 24, 37, 48 across. Start of some advice. I is changing to you. So it's like going to be something like between me and you or like I'm, I, I'm passing it on to you or I, I, if I was you, if I were you, if I would, that's what it is. If I were you, boom. It might be checked at the door. IDs. Not a lot. Few. It has the makings of a hero. It has the makings of a hero. Oh, a deli. <laughs> uh, convention freebies. Swag. Boxer Ali is Layla. I think it's... I can't forget. I can't remember how it's spelled. Summertime Quaff. I don't know. Wait, what's this? Black Panther composer. Uh, Ludwig Goranson, I think. Off as an aid. Okay, got it. I see. Grocery lust. Uh, grocery list and grocery lust. Very good. Okay. Uh, liars poker. Lasted longer than is outstayed. How many sardines are packed in one? In something? Petulant pouty. Took a dive. And one way to be in love. Giddy? Maybe? One you one that you can count on. Nope, it's not giddy. This is a ram. I like that. Uh What's app owner? It's probably meta. Took a dive, ate it. In oil. There you go. There we go. 236 days in a row. Not bad. I mean, this was a little bit slow today for a Tuesday, but um, pretty smooth overall, I guess. We had a little trouble up at the beginning. Uh, if I Were You is the revealer today, and that is hinting to our theme of eyes becoming used. So if I was you, it would mean something else. Uh, I like that. That's fun. Clothes pun. Clothes pin becomes clothes pun. Uh, pectoral fin becomes pectoral fun. Mozzarella stick becomes mozzarella stuck. Grocery list becomes grocery lust. A mozzarella stuck is definitely a fun one. Uh, I like that. Pectoral fun is good. Um, clothes pun had the best clue of them all. This cardboard belt is a waste of paper, for example. That is definitely the best clue of all of them. Um... But uh, a pretty good theme. I, I like it. I like the choices made in the theme entries. Uh, we had some good, I, uh, some other uh, good clues as well. With the, it has the makings of a hero for Delhi is very very good. I like that. Um, we have haiku with the total number of syllables. How hors d'oeuvres may be served on a platter. Uh, Yeah, noon on some clocks for XII. I haven't seen actually Roman numerals in the crossword in a long while. Roman numerals used to be more common, I feel like. Uh, but I, I feel like I haven't seen them in quite a while in the grids. And that is, I think, what threw me off there. Um, nice. All pretty nice. Yeah. Maybe Delhi and Clothes Pond are the best clues of the whole thing. Madly in Love is what that was at the end. Okay, very good. Oh, and one that you can count on is also pretty good for Ram. Um, but nice. Yeah, just a solid Tuesday with some good clues in there and a good theme. Nice uh, hats off to Seth. Nice puzzle. I hope you enjoy that as well. We're, we're getting there. It's, that's Tuesday done. Next comes Wednesday. Come on back tomorrow and let's do Wednesday together or follow along with me. And I hope you have a great rest of your Tuesday, all right? 
uh, I'll see you next time. But until then, spread the word, word nerds. Bye-bye. <laughs>